hey guys welcome back to my channel how are you guys doing today i hope you're having a great week i really do i hope everything is going great for you guys this week so far so today i am doing a amberlyn reed reaction i'm still trying to find my little spot here on this platform and i want to react to some people i react to the rewired soul because he's my mental health person i like to watch well not really like to watch but like to kind of debunk I guess you could say, or put my two cents out there about. And Amberlynn Reed is another one when it comes to weight loss that I want to react to. So definitely let me know if you guys like these type of videos. Comment down below. Let me know how you're feeling. If you're new here, welcome. Hi, this is Journey to Find K, and I'm K. I like to talk about weight loss. I like to talk about mental health. Honestly, I like to talk about anything that gets me up on this platform to have a conversation with you guys. And if it's ment mental health or weight loss, best, I'm coming up here to have a conversation with y'all. And today, Today, I'm going to be reacting to Amberlynn Reed. I haven't watched this. I want to just give you guys my first impressions on this woman. I haven't watched any of her videos directly. I've done a video about her before um, when it came up to her about her mental health. But other than that, I don't really watch her videos. I'll watch people react to her videos. And then there's some times where I'm just like, mm, that's not how I kind of take it or maybe that's not how I feel. So I decided, let me just go ahead and try to react to some of her videos. And if you guys like it and you guys enjoy them, let me know and I'll keep doing it. So let's just go ahead and get straight into this reaction. Let's get into this. So welcome to Vlogmas Day 1. Day 1, y'all. Today is November 30th. You guys will be seeing this on December 1st. I don't know if I could react to every day of her. If well, you guys want me to, like, second. if that's what so the people saw, want, I'll do. A, but I don't know. I don't know. Don't mind the lipstick. This color lipstick makes my lips look really small. As you guys saw, we have a wonderful intro that I actually made with a subscriber. They actually made the video. I put the music in myself. It was a cute. I'm not showing y'all, but it was Gucci cute. Gucci by Krayshawn. I will actually link their Instagram song. down below. I actually have a few clips from yesterday that I'm gonna put in right here. Hey guys, so welcome to my vlog. These wings, I'm loving them done. wings on these the eyeliners. Yesterday we had our little Thanksgiving situation here at home. Now we're going to Becky's family's house. I do. So I just wanted it's to hard say, to put like, a wing, girl. I'm thankful for you guys. It honestly. ain't easy. It has been a crazy journey here on YouTube, but I just appreciate every single one of you. But all of you deserve happiness. I hope you guys had a great Thanksgiving and hope you guys are going to have a great 2020 no. coming up in a month. But now that Thanksgiving's over, we can start talking about Christmas. It's a trip. 2020 is like that. literally here. So I just want to show you guys. It's now here, y'all. It's here. I actually did a tour haul. I was just telling my partner the other day, like, not even the other day, it was earlier today. I was like, oh my God, can you believe like 2020 is a, less than a month away? Like we're right here at the end of a decade. And I'm not going to lie to y'all. I was one of them little kids. Like I swear to God, as soon as 2000, the year 2000 came, we were going to be living like the Jetsons. I really thought the Jetsons was like our future. That's where we would be at right now. And now I'm sitting here like, Wrong. <laughs> yes. So this is one of the <sighs> dresses. I oh, it's got. a cute dress. I love it so much. I do like that dress. I thought it was like perfect for today. I feel like my eyelashes are too wonky, y'all. I'm sorry. Little earrings. Y'all get to see yep. the roughness. I was actually debating. I actually put eyelashes these on. And the ones mm. I'm currently wearing. I love these ones. Those are cute all, too. But I felt like the black went better. The black and did. And the lipstick I'm wearing today, it. I can say as someone who, wow, man, I don't. Someone who was a bigger woman. <laughs> I'm still a bigger woman, not gonna lie. But if you've never seen like my weight loss, I've heard about my weight loss story. I'm gonna link that up here for you guys to check out. I think it's like on this side. Um, so definitely check that out so you guys can learn a little bit more. But in a real quick rundown, I lost 100 pounds naturally just by diet and exercise. Well, now it's at like 80 pounds because I gained 30, but then I've lost 10 of that back. So it's about a good 80 pound loss now. Um, but I remember when I was bigger and I was in my 300s that's the highest I was 320 or maybe even more about 350 I'm not gonna lie I just didn't weigh myself um, but I remembered how important it was for me to feel good like I wanted to look pretty because I was uncomfortable so I went and bought so much makeup I got so much makeup I got so many like different things that I felt would make me feel better about myself on the outside but I wasn't really doing the inside work not gonna lie and it's one thing that even to this day my partner he reminds me of he's like 
you always was like into your makeup and stuff but I'm like now there's a different there's something different about it you know what I mean like now I feel like I don't know it's weird but I can relate to her like how she's like getting dolled up putting the makeup on because that's what I did like I wasn't comfortable in my body all the way but dang on I was going to make myself feel better so putting that makeup on helped sorry about my partner in the background cover girl in 650 Pro he's playing the game <laughs> oh my gosh i pronounced that wrong so i really just wanted to say hi tomorrow is actually day one for vlogmas because i film november 30th uploaded on december 1st got ads so i just sorry. wanted to say hi I'm never going to take them out because that's y'all's money. You know what I mean? I would want someone to let my little ads run. That's that. So you guys will be seeing this on Vlogmas day one, which will be December 1st. Hey, guys. So we actually got back from the little... I'm going to try to turn this down just Thanksgiving a little bit. dinner situation. I just want to say that I had, like, a blast. I had so much fun. We ate. Okay. We played games. There was so much laughter. Like, I just had a really good time. But you guys know that feeling when you know you're fixing to get, like, a sore throat and you just, like, feel it coming in? Well, I was sitting throat there. Throat feel dry. And I was like, I feel like I'm getting a sore throat. But then I had a moment where I was like, okay, maybe it's just allergies because I just got done holding Becky's sister's cat. And my eyes were itching, did it. So I was like, allergy, smallergy, I'll be totally fine. Well, long story short... My nose is stuffy. I have cats too, and I know I, I I would always say I was allergic to cats, and I have my moments. But you have she has cats too. I don't know. Maybe I'm. I don't know. I don't know. Heart hurts really bad. Sneezing. So I've caught myself cold. Um, I already have a day cool and night cool <laughs> from when I thought I was sick, from when I was shivering and. Had a really high fever. You guys remember that when I went to the ER. Turns out I wasn't sick, but now I am, so hello. Um, the fact that, like, Vlogmas is here, and we're not going to be starting off with a bang. We're going to be starting off with, like, a cough and a sniffle. I mean, I just got to live through it, though. But it's the I, weather. Like, doesn't even matter. Like, I had such a good it's day the today, weather. and I'm just feeling great, like, you guys. Besides, like, those few little health things, like, I'm dealing with, like, I really am just feeling really good. Can you imagine how I'd feel if, like, I wasn't going through, like, health problems? And no, I'm not just talking about, like, a cold. Like, that's nothing, like, high. Um, I'm talking about just, like, the deeper things. Um, on Monday, I'm actually calling a doctor. Um, and I'm going to make an appointment with them. Just some things I got to do. I'm also going to call the vet on Monday. Anyways, now I'm just rambling. So, so now that we're all cut up, I just want to say I'm probably never wearing this lipstick again. Because it's like seeping into my like foundation, which is not cute. It is another ad, y'all. But to help that, you, sh you should really use um, a lip liner. Lip liner yeah, helps with that a lot. I don't know if she did or not. It is but. the NYX Powder Puff Lippy, which is surprising to me. But I did over it just to add like a little who knows what. I did add um, cover girl, which is a little who knows what. Inches, so maybe that's what did it. But look, no, not cute, y'all. I'm scared. This never happens. It's from Thanksgiving, I guess. Becky and I weren't here yesterday, so I didn't realize. Wow. <laughs> So I'm gonna work on these because this is a madhouse right now. I'm gonna put on some music and start cleaning. So round one of dishes is completed. I definitely don't mind doing them because Ricky made all the food and it was bomb diggity. Um, I regret not having leftovers. I only had one plate. Um, That's and enough. It, it was a piled on plate. It was super good. But yeah. Yeah. Then oh, they were enough. God. I was sweating while doing but this. But didn't she just say that she I wasn't there? I don't water. know. Maybe the, she said she didn't because have leftovers, but they weren't so there. So I, was, I don't like, know. With, like, really hot water. I don't but I know. That don't add up right really there. Really pretty um, Christmas tablecloth that Becky actually picked out and bought herself. Are these our um, videos all the they time? We're decorating for Christmas, but it's going to be a different day. Can y'all share with me if this is like how her videos are all the time? Because like, I don't know if I could. I don't know. Is this really how she does her videos? Like, who 
Okay. Let me so just. Everyone it's 18 busy. minutes just, long, oh, and I'm five minutes in, and it out. feels like it's taking so, forever. Look at how gorgeous that is. She chose that. I'm like, damn, that's fancy as hell. But yeah, we're gonna do the Christmas tree one video, and then we're gonna do like a decorating, like other stuff for another video. I just figured that'd be fun for you guys. She also got this movie. We have so many Christmas movies. Um, we haven't started watching. Also, I give her props for being so close, like with the camera. Like even now, like with you guys being that far away from me with my camera, like I feel so uncomfortable. I feel like you're all in my heezy and stuff. Like I, I give her props for that because I was never that comfortable at my size. Like you could not get too close. And then I also give her mad props because just sitting there would have had me sweating. Like I'm such a sweater. <laughs> So I'm like, whenever I see someone who's like bigger than I was or like the same size as me when I was that size, like, and you're not sweating, like I get, I'm jealous, like legit jealous. Cause I was a sweater. Like I would sit there and just talk. You just see little bead, little bead coming down. And I was so embarrassed. I was so embarrassed, which was another reason why, you know, I did eventually just get up and start, you know, trying to lose weight because I was a sitting down sweater. I just sweat all the time. Nanny, I, we need to watch one. But she's so close this to her face, like, Eloise. that shows confidence, but really does. It. But Becky got that, so we're probably gonna be watching that. Y'all, I've been waiting for that mailman. It's been raining for everyone. We had rain out here in bad, Arizona. Bad weather day. For Thanksgiving. It's supposed to like storm. It's already started. Got another ad, y'all, just warning you. On and off. I'll, I'll eventually get a blocker. I don't know. I just like giving y'all your money, you know? Everyone now. know that's where the money comes from is those five second ads. I'm supposed to be getting the package today. Usually they set it right here and I don't want it to get wet. So I'm just like waiting. He might put it in the mailbox it's because it's small. Y'all, I'm about to go in that rain. Wish me luck. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. Look at her walking. From what I know about her, this is on purpose. She literally did this on purpose so that her haters can't say that she wouldn't walk out there and that she can't walk. From what I know, because I keep up with a little bit. I don't watch her videos, but like I said, I'll be watching reaction videos of her every once in a while because I'm really like trying to venture out into different parts of YouTube. And I know for sure that she did this on purpose. So that way people can say like they can't say that she didn't really walk out there or whatever the case is. And honestly, I'm just like, get it, girl, because I wouldn't have took my butt out there in the rain. Mm -mm. and not at that size and knowing that she has the tendency of falling i wouldn't have did it i wouldn't have did it and i'm even like going in the rain now like but we know why she did it we know okay yeah she do it she did it on purpose yep y'all i don't think clearly sometimes i forgot i was sick y'all i went out there and i'm sick it was freezing out there. I didn't wear a coat or a jacket or a sweater. I don't use my brain sometimes at all. But you um, wanted to prove a point. That's why. But hair got wet. It's such a beautiful angle. Angle Lynn. <laughs> Amazon Lynn. I'm an Amazon free. One thing that she's but trying yeah. to hide though, and it's not working, is with her talking and stuff like that. She had a breath. Like, and that's one thing that that was something that motivated me to I couldn't do that no more. Cause it's hard. Like walking to walk that distance and back and to be that out of breath hurts. Your lungs feel like they're gonna give out. And she's trying to hide it and she's trying to show that it doesn't bother her, but it bothers her. And it bothers me because I can't imagine how that chest feels like. <sighs> These but are signs you need to take seriously, people. It was getting can't wet, Can't breathe. It was getting wet. And I don't want this to get wet because it's a book. This is one list a day for three years. So example, July 4th would be hard to reach places I would love to explore. She has so many journals, so you though. That on July 4th for three years in a row. And I'm not going to lie. This is, and it's something that I've had to slow down myself, is I used to be a journal freak. Like, 
I would buy journals all the time and I didn't care. Like I still have like a stack like this big in my room as we speak that I have not touched in like I've had them like over a year or two because I used to be such a journal freak. I would go out there and get any cute journal, anything like I had a huge thing about polka dots. I had to think about Chevron. I had to think about like stripes. Like I literally have so many journals that if I just leave, just let them sit there for the rest of like for the next like five years and I use one every, well, no, not every year. Well, if I use one for like Okay, so I have a good like 20 journals sitting there. So imagine if I use one like a month, once a month or something like that, like I would be able to get through them, but they're just sitting there because they're cute and I wanted to use them. And now she's buying these because she wants another one. And it's, it's a three year one this time. It's a three year one, but it's like, it's, why are you buying it? It's useless spending. Like something I've been noticing that she, and I can kind of relate to too as well. And this is where it's like, are you really taking, this is where my mental health side comes in. This is where it comes in because it's like, are you taking that serious like right now? Like, are you really doing like the work that you're supposed to be doing? Because the spending and the um, spending of your money the way that she is and buying things is a big part, I believe. And I'm not someone who's going to diagnose, but I believe that plays a big part with her mental health. There's a, if I lost the ability to It goes smell, hand in hand. I miss smelling. It really does. Another one. Random. A lot of people don't realize like do weight this. loss, anything Ooh, medical, sure. it goes with your mental See, health. Like. That was if your mental health's not Cute. right, your the your medical's not going to be okay. And if your medical health isn't, your physical like health this. isn't okay, your and mental health's not going to be okay. And she's in this wonderful cycle right here. Track of where you I used to so be that way. Much done with the dishes. We just have that a little bit left and some stuff soaking in the sink. But I'm about to make me some lunch. I have made this before recently. It's really good. So I'm going to show you guys kind of what it is. All right. So, first things first. I just want her to get healthy. Onion. And before and anyone potato. says anything, you can tell she's not healthy. We're gonna need the way you're breathing. Something. Your legs. And like I said, I get it. She's doing this on purpose to show people like, hey, I can get up and I can walk around and because there's a lot of talk about like how much she can actually do. But I feel like it's taking her a long time to do those dishes. Um, the fact that you we were breathing so hard coming back in for your package at your mailbox. Um, I'm just looking at her legs right now. I've never... When you watch reaction channels, sometimes you don't realize like the actuality of like a person's size or what the video really looks like because a lot of times, you know, they have the video smaller or whatever the case may be. But like sitting here and really looking at her legs, looking at her body, it looks painful. It looks very painful. Like the hump in the neck, I used to have that. That's a sign of too much sugar, too much carbs. Like, sad. It's really sad. So I've actually been using fresh broccoli, but I don't have any right now. So I'm just gonna use frozen broccoli, cauliflower, and carrots. And chicken salsa and hot sauce. My preferred hot sauce, tapatio. So what I'm gonna do I'm is- I love some tapatio and some eggs. I'm going to oh. cut the chicken in just like really small pieces, season it how you want, cook it in a pan, microwave this, microwave this, obviously chop the onion any size you want, cook it with the, um, chicken and i'll show you guys the next step pretty simple it's gonna be weird to some of you guys i have a weird taste bud i guess but it's actually really good so the chicken and onions are doing their thing okay i do cook with water okay. instead of oil i've learned i learned it that from somebody too it does sure. so and a lot of times the meat, if you get a good meat, and it has its own fat that you could cook with. cauliflower. I've seen that a lot. I don't do it. I use butter. Done. But I'm keto, so. Big mm. potato in the microwave. 
This is gonna be a little bit of leftovers. My plate ready to go so I can show you guys how I plate it. Okay, you guys, now it's time for the plating. Gonna get me a spoon. First thing I do, veggies. This is a lot better with uh -oh. steamed. I was reading her trash can. Just trust me on that. Please. <laughs> I'm like, what does it say? No boxes. Now that I've learned to like truly cook steamed broccoli, it's like my jam. Okay. Okay. Now I'm gonna get me. I see nothing wrong with frozen knife. veggies as long as it's it's better than a can. It's better than a can. Open. I think she should skip hot. out on the potato. <laughs> I really do. This. But you know, it's a good variation of a healthy really meal. Crazy, but that's okay. Place it on top. I'm not trolling. I swear. You're going to cut it in half. Whew. Open it. You guys literally see the steam, cause I do. <laughs> you guys are gonna take your chicken, place it in the middle, like so. Just enough, just enough, I meant to say, <laughs> to satisfy you. Oh, I got another ad, but this yeah. food, bruh. You know what this food reminds me of? It reminds me of when I used to work in my rehab. Okay, so I worked in a rehab with severely mentally ill women. And um, so it treated their mental illness and their substance abuse issues. And we would have to help them with living skills. So one of the things that we did is I always had to assign them chores and it was a swapped out weekly and they had a menu to follow. And this literally reminds me of some of the meals that they would try to feed these people as nutrition. <laughs> and they never liked it like never liked it now I just, it's that's just what it reminds me of it reminds me of when I worked at my rehab and these were the type of meals and we always went in there and made something else out of this type of ingredients like I I, I don't and then like the healthy part is kind of gone out the window now because you threw on all the salsa. Salsa is not that healthy, people. Sorry if you really believe that. Um, you have this big old potato, and then you had the good chicken and the veggies. Like I would have just took the potato off if you wanted the chicken with that. Put the chicken with that with the salsa on the side, but take the potato away. Like you're just. But it literally reminds me of when I worked at my rehab. Bite. Right. And then. I want to cook the for hot you. Sauce. I want to cook for you. Like what is this? Which this comes out super slow. <laughs> So, oh, bam! Dinner is served. And I know this looks crazy, but trust me, this is bomb right here. And I didn't mean to say dinner; I meant to say lunch. But either way, angle in. So, so we want to watch you eat this. Oh, come it's on. All meant to be and that's a massive portion. Together, like okay? So. Like, if you really sit here and yeah. look at that, Veggie. the camera's not giving you no lie. It's not because it's super potato. close. She had a big potato. Those potatoes are not little. She had a big-ass potato, a gang of chicken, and a gang of veggies, and a mm -hmm. gang of salsa. That is a big-ass portion. This is why I see people do these reactions, because, no. She could have totally took that potato away. She does it on purpose. So even with Vlogmas, I'm still gonna okay. be doing comments of How the many day. We got left? Ham and chicken girl. Oh, she's gonna do this for the though. next five minutes. There was no turkey for our friends giving. I was very sad about it. Um, our friends giving was very last minute. So there was no turkey. If it wasn't so last minute, I probably would have bought one. But we did have turkey at Becky's family's house though. Welcome to Hater Nation. Sign here, here, and here's your name badge. Cute. Laugh emoji, laugh emoji, laugh emoji. Okay. 
I Why does she hate this? Like, I always hear that you have to hit, like, what, 10 minutes to get a certain amount of, like, ads or whatever, but she's way past that. We're, like, at 15 minutes in. She basically still has to do whatever AL asks her to do. Very, very wrong. Um, I'm not forcing Becky to make a decoration. This was Becky's idea. She was actually really excited for it. And if you watch the vlog, we actually went to Walmart for her. Yeah, I don't because think she wanted to. Go I think Becky's just um, the, um, a crafty person. She seems like that from all the little reactions wrong. I've watched with her in it. Um, she seems like a, a crafty person. Is only going to go shopping for homeless people and take it to the shelters only because I want to. That's also very wrong. Just because I want to help homeless people doesn't mean Becky does not as well. She really wants to help them as well. And I just think it's so funny that something as, you know, innocent as going to a homeless shelter has to be, like, hated on. Because you don't have to do to that for your really following odd. because you put it out there for them to hate on it. Do. You share that information, you put it out there for people to like, comment I'm on. Not in control of her. I don't understand She's people with platforms me. who don't get that. Walk, that also helps with weight loss. Yes, I have been walking. And as you guys remember, I actually cried recently about this. It was a few nights ago. Um, I went back and I was watching an old vlog from April 6th or around there. And I could only walk for a minute and 16 seconds. And it broke my heart. So I decided to get up and actually time myself. And I was able to walk for nine minutes. Nice. I could have kept going, but I had you really bad back pain. And that's the only mm. reason why I stopped. And it was just crazy to me that I was able the to. The more she builds that and starts walking like more, the less her back will hurt. Really hard. The more weight she loses, the less her back will hurt. If it wasn't for my back pain. These are all and signs that she needs to lose weight. And Ricky was so sweet. And he was just like, you need to be proud of yourself. Like, look how amazing you're doing. Like, he was trying to give me that, like, pep talk I needed because I just started bawling. Like, it was ridiculous. I honestly hope the best for everyone here. Happy holidays. Same to you, blue gypsy doll. She's really going to Let's do this till the end of the video. Let's touch every single object in Walmart while Becky is having an out-of-body moment in the background. Oh, that's funny. No, Becky was just patiently waiting. She knew that I wanted to vlog. Like, there's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> like, you guys read way too much into things that aren't even there, like, at all. I almost wish you guys were right so I don't have to constantly, like, defend myself because it's, like, annoying... But you know the funny thing about touching things in Walmart is that everyone does it to be able to. Doesn't like, mean you I have know to. A lot of people hated that You're I was grown. touching the Pioneer Woman Bowls, but it's just really funny because they were all stacked together and they all had different designs. How does one choose what bowl they want without touching the bowls? That is why when you buy something, especially like um silverware or bowls and plates and cups she could have ended this video already you go home and you wash them i don't know <laughs> why she does this walmart is the only store you go to because it's pretty much the only store where i live you have to drive quite a minute to get to other stores walmart is open 24 7 it has majority of everything you need i also really love kroger and tj maxx and let me tell you something if there was a target nearby i would probably be there every single day so this is the last one I'm going to do. Thank you. Girl, I love watching your videos. Thank you so much, Flower Power. Like, I really appreciate that. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed day one of Vlogmas. I told you Vlogmas is probably going to be super boring, but that's okay. You know, just live in life how it is right now. But I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. Well, that was fun. Um, I... Yeah, um, so that's my first ever Amberlynn Reed video, um, or reaction. Honestly, a lot of it just had a lot of flashbacks watching this, um, hearing the breathing, seeing, actually being able to see firsthand um, her size by watching the video myself. It's kind of like, wow, now I understand why so many people say things. Um, like I said, I had flashback because I remember breathing like that. I remember feeling that way. Was I her size? No, but I was 300 something pounds. Like, so I wasn't little. And it's, I just look at it as these are all little things that she could look at and things that she could really take a moral inventory and realize that 
these are her signs that she needs to get healthy. These are this is her time to really take things seriously. Um, I feel like she did that whole walking montage to kind of be like, hey, you guys, guess what? I can walk. Look at this um, to kind of show some of the progress that she has been making that she doesn't want to talk about because, you know, she's seen people speculate about some things. But other than that, um, if that's the case, keep it up. Keep up the good work. Like I, it was really good to see, you know, the walking part and the cooking, standing up. The portion sizes could have been way smaller. That potato could have gone. All that salsa wasn't necessary. Like when she put her plate down, it really showed how much food was on that plate. It didn't seem that much. But then when I really looked, I was like, OK, yeah, as you can try to eat healthy, but portion sizes matter. Portion sizes matter. So stay active. I'm hoping she stays active. I'm hoping she cuts back on them portions. Better food choices, of course, is always great. But um, and it was just one of those things where it's like, yeah, now I understand why so many people make these videos. I understand why so many people have stuff to say, because looking at it firsthand, it's like, wow, um, she needs to get it together. She needs to get it together. So let me know what you guys think. How do you guys feel down in the comments below? I'd love to hear from you guys. Do you guys want me to do another video about her? Do you want me to follow her through Vlogmas and give you guys my point of view? Because like I said, as someone who used to be big and who's trying to actively not be that size any longer, I I sometimes have different points of view and I also throw in maybe some mental health aspects point into it too as well so let me know what you guys think I'll catch you guys in my next video and I'll talk to y'all later bye